A very good morning to all of you and welcome to our Mass on this, the 12th Sunday after Pentecost. Worship the Lord in the beauty of holiness. Let the whole earth stand in awe of him. Blessed be God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Blessed be his kingdom now and forever. Amen. Let us say together the collect for purity. Almighty God, to you all hearts are open, all desires known, and from you no secrets are hidden. Cleanse the thoughts of our hearts by the inspiration of your Holy Spirit that we may perfectly love you and worthily magnify your holy name through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Glory to God in the highest and a peace to his people on earth. Lord God, heavenly King, almighty God and Father, we worship you, we give you thanks, we praise you for your glory. Lord Jesus Christ, only Son of the Father, Lord God, Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. You are seated at the right hand of the Father. Receive our prayer. For you alone are the Holy One. You alone are the Lord. You alone are the Most High, Jesus Christ. With the Holy Spirit, in the glory of God the Father. Amen. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. Almighty God, you have given your only Son to be for us a sacrifice for sin and also an example of godly life. Give us grace to receive thankfully the fruits of his redeeming work and to follow daily in the blessed steps of his most holy life. Through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. We now have the readings. The first reading is taken from St. Paul's letter to the Ephesians. Brothers and sisters, be careful how you live, not as unwise people, but as wise making the most of the time because the days are evil. So do not be foolish, but understand what the will of the Lord is. Do not get drunk with wine, for that is debauchery, but be filled with the Spirit as you sing psalms and hymns and spiritual songs amongst yourselves, singing and making melody to the Lord in your hearts, giving thanks to God the Father at all times of everything, in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord be with you. The Gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ according to John. Jesus said to the crowd, I am the living bread that came down from heaven. Whoever eats of this bread will live forever. And the bread that I will give for the life of the world is my flesh. The Jews then disputed among themselves, saying, How can this man give us his flesh to eat? So Jesus said to them, Very truly I tell you, unless you eat the flesh of the Son of Man and drink his blood, you have no life in you. Those who eat my flesh and drink my blood have eternal life, and I will raise them up on the last day. For my flesh is true food, and my blood is true drink. Those who eat my flesh and drink my blood abide in me, and I in them. Just as the living Father sent me, and I live because of the Father, so whoever eats me will live because of me, 
This is the bread that came down from heaven, not like that which your ancestors ate, and they died. But the one who eats this bread will live forever. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to Christ, Lord. 